min price. That's a 6k profit. If you want any cheap and reliable Ultimate Team coins, make sure to check out MuleFactory.com. There's a link in the description. They have the best prices and make sure to use my discount code IHAS5 at checkout for a discount. What is up? Welcome back to a brand new sniping video on the channel and you guys need to try these filters. They are absolutely crazy right now. You can make so, so many coins. If you guys are enjoying the sniping content from me, again, it'd be appreciated if you could leave a like for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe down below to the channel 90% of you guys who watch my videos are not subscribed so it'd be great if you could hit that subscribe button below of course it wouldn't be a sniping video without brand new squad builder challenges so we don't have a marquee matchups this time but we have a brand new live squad builder challenge and I don't know why EA don't sort them in the newest order but this is the challenge clash of titans you can get yourself a rare mega pack from this challenge which is probably one of the best rewards from an SBC in quite some time so there's no specific nations or clubs needed it is just four players at least from the same country two players at least from the same club and an 80 rated squad with five rare so basically any solid nations for squads they have risen up in prices and certain players who are used for solid links have gone to the moon they are worth so much the prices of these players are rapidly changing quite quickly just because of the amount of people actually listing them up and then selling them but they are crazy to snipe right now if you can get on them so the first player i have is damian suarez a lot of people are using uruguay teams for this SBC, so obviously then the uruguay players have gone up and damian suarez he is one that has gone up a lot since so many of these cards as well do get listed up it can actually be quite tough to find the minimum buy now of the cards so i recommend just listing them quite a bit under just so you can make enough coins well to guarantee that sells actually damian suarez on the market you can see a lot of him for about 4.8 thousand coins if we go down 4.5 there's about a page then there's one card for 4.3 one card for 4.4 so i could say if you want a quick sale list them for like 4.2 4.3 thousand coins because you'll be able to snipe this guy for super super cheap let's look at my transfer list so this first card i did list in the hype and obviously He's skyrocketed and then dropped a bit. But this Damien Suarez here, I sniped earlier. 1,000 coins for this guy. Yep, 1K. And I'll just go 4.1K just to make sure he sells that super... Look at that instant sale. That's 3,000 coins profit right there what did that take us like 10 seconds i could type this video 3k in 10 seconds but yeah you can make over 2k a minute with these filters so damien suarez if i'm gonna sell him for around 4.123 i want to pick him up for about 3.5 or less because you can get some very nice snipes with these players you do have to be fast when the right card gets listed you can make some big big profit we're gonna give it a go and see what sort of cards we can pick up here we go 1k oh we've missed the first one but you can see again that would have been another 3,000 coin profit if i managed to pick that one up here we go 3.1 oh i've missed that one you do have to be pretty pretty quick on these players it doesn't matter if you miss five and then pick one up because you're making a big profit compared to normal sniping filters just checking this price again if we go 4.4k there's one card like this guy's price is going all around the place but yeah 4.5 i reckon is the max so 4.4 is our sale price which means we can snipe them up to 4k for a minimum of a 200 coin profit there we go 4k picked him up i'll list for 4.4 and he should sell on it's a bit risky buying this non rare card for 4k there it could be the event that he crashes but he seems in decent demand so we'll buy another one for 4,000 coins on a snipe and then they should sell on pretty quickly oh my god why did i buy the one for 4k 500 coins if you would have picked up snipe you would have made 4,000 coins profit on a non rare gold card here we go 1.5. Oh, we've missed another one again i've lowered the price because i'm scared that his price is tanking because so many people are listing him up. But be careful before you snipe. Double check the price. And I reckon give yourself more room for profit. Just in case the prices do drop. Here we go. 1.8. Oh my god I've missed another one. Well you can see our card sold on which is good. But now we're on to the next player. So the other player from this challenge. People were linking is Godin. So again, from Uruguay, around the same price, going for about 4.4 thousand coins. As we can see here, a little bit cheaper actually, maybe 4.3. A lot of cards were getting listed up. As you can see, every price, they're all in the 59th minute. We'll call it 4K just to make sure he sells on super quick. Let's hope we get a bit more luck with Godin and can pick up a min price snipe. Here we go, 600. <laughs> I nearly just called that. That's crazy. Well, it's, it's nearly min price, 600 coins. It's cheap enough. So again, that would have been like a 3K profit. 
3.5. It's not the best, but at least I picked up a card. We can list that for 4K. It just sell on very quickly. Another 3K, list off for 4K. If we ignore EA tax, we're making like a K a minute. Nearly, like there's no cuts. You saw that card. And we'll go We'll go for one more goad in to see if I can get... <clears throat> okay, we've missed that 3K. I'll do, I'll do one more. Just, to... okay. Eight... <clears throat> oh no. Like these filters, they're insane. 850 coins for the goad in there. So moving on to our next player, we are looking at the Belgians. And our first card is Thomas Vermaelen. So again, for some reason, a load of people are using Vermaelen in this SBC. He's going for about 3,000 coins on the market. We'll go 2.5 or lower. And then first search, 2.5 picked him up. Um, that was not scripted or anything. Yeah, there you go. I'll list it for 2.9. Again, just to make sure that he sells on quickly. And we'll keep looking for Vermaelens and see if we can pick up a better deal than that one. Here we go. 1.5. Oh, when it says your bid cannot be completed, it basically means you sniped at the same time. So I was very, very close on that one. But next one, we've got it. Here we go. 2K. Oh my God. Why did that put me so late? I was quick on the searches. There we go. Next one, 2.5. Of course I've secured that one. For Marlin, 2.5K. We'll list them up for 2.9 just to make the quick sale. Easy stuff for Marlin, but we're going to move on to some more expensive players. We do have ourselves another Belgian and it is Timothy Castagny. That was a deal, by the way, for 2.5k, if you were wondering. He's around this 4,000 coin mark. I feel like all of the players in this SBC are hovering around that price, which is insane. So as you can see, 4.3, we'll list him for 4.4 thousand coins. We'll go 4k and under, and we'll get searching. First search, 4k, missed that one. 4k, bought that one. We'll list out for 4.4. I know with these filters, you can just take the small profit. So here it's only 200 coin profit. But again, it's our second search. Or we can lower the buy now to say like 3.5 and try and pick up some big snipes, which is my plan. Here we go, 1.9. Oh my God. Here we go again, 800. Oh, these filters are insane. If only I could pick up these snipes, I literally could make like 100K in 10 minutes. 1.2. Oh my God, I've missed that one again. But yeah, Castagne, again, another card where a lot of them get listed cheap. Please, EA, just let me... There we go. 2,000 coins. We've picked him up. Again, can flip him for 4K. It's such easy stuff. Where well, it was 4.4. I'll go 4.3 again. Just to get that very fast sale. We'll get one more card. 2.3. Oh, my God. I was... 3.4. Uh, yeah, I, I guess it works. We picked him up for 3.4. Again, we'll sell this one for 4.3. And now, the last player we have is where we can make some huge profits. It is Michi... Batshuayi, and he's not 4k, he's not 5k, he is 6,000 coins for a non-rare gold card. It's, it's insane, I don't know why people are bumping these prices up, but yeah, 6k, I'll probably list them at 5.9, 5.8, just to get that quick sale. But I'm going to snipe him for under 5k, and I'm going to show you guys, okay, well, uh, first search, again, I don't know what is happening with my luck, but yeah, there's 5k. List them for 5.7. We'll search 4.5k and get a huge snipe. I'm trying to find like a 5k profit on a single card. <clears throat> oh, 1.8. Again, that's a 4k profit. Here we go. 4.3. Picked them up. It's a decent. It's about 1,000 coins on this snipe. People always list on the like bumper values. So it defaults you to 5.8. So if you list 5.7, you're most likely always going to undercut the next people on the market. I want to get one for like 1,000 coins. Here we go. 1.5. Oh, come on. Someone just let me win a card. Here we go. 700. Oh, my God, no. Well, we just saw our 5K profit card. And I completely... 2.5. Yes, there we go. This is a 3K profit. 2.5. I feel like his price is actually slowly crashing. So I'm just going to go 5.5 to make sure he sells instantly. 3,000 coin profit. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you did enjoy. Again, Please drop a like on the video to help out with the YouTube algorithm and subscribe down below to the channel to see more sniping content from me. So if you want to find another video to help you guys out on FIFA, click to watch it over here and I'll see you on my next video.